What is up, guys? It's your boy Branson DD here, back with another video, and I I fell asleep for like about two hours, and I and I woke up and I was like, oh shoot, I need to upload. So I'm gonna be reacting to how to make ten secret hiding spots. So let's get right to it. I ain't making a gaming video today. Sorry for the best teaching you 10 ways to hide money or personal belongings all around the house in plain sight so nobody can find it. So make sure you're a subscriber and check out the end of the video for a giveaway. Let's do this. Here's an awesome hiding spot that sits in plain sight and you probably never even noticed it. These electrical boxes right here, I wouldn't suggest the power ones, but the ones for coaxial cable or for your old phone jacks, they're epic. When you open them up, there's a huge plastic box that lets you hide something like a USB drive, some money, whatever it might be. So let me open up and show you what it looks like. There we go. And as you can see in here is my stash of a few hundred bucks I have laying around. And now you know where I keep my money. That's not true. So of course you don't want to mess with an electrical box like that, but these right here are just dead space, so you can hide a wad of money, a USB drive, or anything small. Here's a great spot for an envelope of cash that already exists in your house and it's under your sink. Check this out. In the front of most sinks, there's this panel. Sometimes it's two and it looks like drawers, but they don't open, of course, because there's a sink in the way. So behind this, it's recessed and there's enough room to slip a book or an envelope. And what's really cool is there's usually strips of plywood or wood that holds the top piece and the bottom piece of the wood together on this framing. So when we go inside, I'll show you what that looks like. Essentially, all you got to do is feel inside and then this slips between the wood and then the envelope slides right in and it's being held by a strip of wood just behind this and it's a perfect hiding spot. You can't even feel it unless you reach inside to grab it. So if you look under the sink, you can see here's that recessed area and here's that envelope hiding right in plain sight. Another epic hiding spot that's sitting right in plain sight in your house is behind pictures like this. If you happen to have pictures that are on this wood frame behind it, it's completely hollow. So you have a lot of spots to hide. And on top of that, there's wood framing. That you I have a mirror in my bathroom. Uh, like, the bathroom would be probably like right there through that wall. I'll show you in, I might show you in a minute. Behind this little, uh, like, oval mirror, there's a big square hole. Where a old mirror slip an envelope behind. So check this out. This one is really deep up here. We have one that's thinner, super thin. And I'll pull this off, and you can clearly see that behind it, you can slip an envelope, and there is where you can stash your cash. She's never going to find that. Hey, here's an epic place to hide something in the bathroom. Check this out. In the back where the water is, open this container up, and this is where you can stash some valuables or some money. All you gotta do is dry out a water bottle, mm -hmm. put your stuff inside, lock it back up, and then secure it inside of here so it doesn't interfere with how it flushes. Stick it off to one of the sides. You could even tape it in place if you want. In this case, this toilet's perfect for just dropping it in right there, and it won't interfere with it flushing. Watch this. It's just going to go up and down in this corner, and that is good to go. Another simple and very convenient hiding spot in your house is vents. Now, some vents are up high. You just unscrew them, open them out, and you have access to all the ducting. You can stick something there, but the floor ones are even easier. you got this big box here, and look what I have. Hidden inside tape here is a big container of moolah. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you, you're mm -hmm. never going to find the money in my house. Alright. Here we go. Oh yeah. This was my favorite hiding spot as a kid. Check this out. On the back of a drawer, just simply tape an envelope and that's where you can stash some cash. Now what's cool is I got this on Craigslist and this came with it. Pretty cool, right? Now don't forget you can stash money or personal belongings in any kind of item that you eat or use, like a deck of cards. 
No one would ever imagine there's money hiding in here. Or, let's say, a container of Pringles. Check this out. Look inside. It's still got Pringles, but watch this. Open it up, pour it out, and it's just a few Pringles on top of... What's this? A styrofoam cup that's been cut, and now it's just tons of money. What a great hiding spot. If you're worried someone's going to eat your Pringles, then hide your money or the item in some other container that you know they dislike. Another great place to stash stuff that's in plain sight is old medicine containers. Now, you can get some of the vitamin C containers that are huge, or even something like some headache medicine. Check this out. Inside of here is this big wad of money. And as they say, money is the best medicine. Of course, make it a medicine that only you take. And if you really are concerned about it, stash your money in there and then put some new cotton balls on top so it looks like brand new medicine and hide it in the back. Most of us have old paint cans laying around. If you have any that dry out, that's a perfect spot to stash some goodies. Just stick whatever you want inside of there, even some Christmas gifts, tap it back on, and no one will ever find it. Here's an epic way to hide a car key or even some cash. Can you buy like a $30,000 Rolex and you don't want your wife to find out? Hide it in paint. Get a tennis ball, cut a little hole in it. Oh, I'm hungry. And then stuff whatever you want inside, close it up, and it actually looks like a regular tennis ball. You can dump a couple balls out, hide it at the bottom, just like this, boom. And no one would ever know a thing. Let me show you real quick how you make it. Grab yourself a tennis ball and cut right through the fuzzy part. Once it's cut, it'll pry open like a Pac-Man. Stuff anything you want inside and then close it up and you can't even tell. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed those hiding spots. If you liked any of them, hit that like button right now. And do me a huge favor. Head over to my Facebook fan page and follow me there. Okay, what he just said. Hit the subscribe button. I don't know if he said that, but still hit the subscribe button and hit that like button. Get me to, I'll say, five likes and I'll have a gaming, I'll have a video of Call of Duty. So, and I forgot, but now, hang on, it's a little dark. I need this side on. Oh, yeah. This side on. Okay, so this is the mirror, right? Where I go to my selfies and shorts, so I have to. Okay, so. Can you guys see it? There's like a hole. I don't know if you can see it. It's dark, but. It's like a hole right there. So, see you guys, and I'm using this program, and I have to go to my home screen and press this, and see.